Hi, today I'll be showing you how to change the default PDF viewer in your Google Chrome browser. So most of the modern browsers allow you to actually view PDF files directly in the browser using their own native PDF plugin. Most of the time this works just fine, but sometimes you might get a message saying that your PDF cannot be opened and you need to update your version of Adobe Reader. This could come up even though you have the newest version of Adobe Reader because it's not actually Adobe Reader that's being used to open your PDF, but it's your browser. So let me show you how to change away from your browser's PDF viewer to Adobe Reader. So first I'll open Google Chrome and I'll actually show you a sample PDF to see what it looks like when Chrome opens it up. So I'll type in sample PDF and I'll click on the first result here, which is some sample ACT questions. So you'll see that it opens up and this is not Adobe Reader. It's in my browser and this toolbars are actually coming from Chrome's PDF plugin. So how do we change that? First, what you want to do is actually click into the URL bar and you'll type in Chrome and then a colon, two forward slashes, and then the word plugins. So one more time, what you want to type in is Chrome, C-H-R-O-M-E, then colon, two forward slashes, and plugins, and hit enter. This should redirect to the plugins setting page for your Google Chrome browser. If you go somewhere else or it's saying the page cannot be displayed, verify that you use forward slashes and not backslashes. So on here, we can actually see the different plugins that are running behind the scenes that Chrome is utilizing. One of which is the Chrome PDF Viewer, which is actually enabled by default. What this also means is that the Adobe Reader, the software that you probably installed on your computer to open PDF files when you're not in the browser, has been disabled. So what you can actually do is click Enable on Adobe Reader and this will automatically disable the Chrome PDF Viewer. Now without even having to click Save or do anything, we can go back to that sample PDF that we were viewing earlier. And you'll see that initially Chrome is going to block Adobe Reader, but that is now the program that's trying to open. So we want to click on this little blocked plugin icon and say always allow plugins on this page. Again, you may want to actually go in and manage plugin blocking and set it so that your favorite websites already allow this particular plugin, which is Adobe Reader. I'll close out of that for now since I've allowed PDF or Adobe Reader to open PDFs and you'll see now that I actually get Acrobat's PDF plugin. If I click the little button here I get the more familiar look. I still am in the browser but I get all of the familiar and traditional options and I have the option to save it to my computer and then open it in the full version of Adobe Reader. So this was how you change your PDF viewer in Google Chrome from the Chrome PDF viewer to Adobe Reader.